Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019-2020 Panini Chronicles Basketball Fat Pack Edition. It looks like this, right? Or, or value pack, whatever, whatever you want to call them. But but those those retail pack editions. Uh, this is two box break number one, random team break number one with an early bird special. So if you're one of the first 20 to buy spots in this, you'll be entered to win a free spot. So everyone from Jarrell down to Adam, you have a chance of winning an extra spot in this. Thanks for being early birds. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Five and a one, six times for each uh, for this list. So it'll be top person after six. One, two, three, four, five. and sixth and final time. After six, it's D Turk. Damn, nice. You win an extra spot after six. There you are right there. All right, so now let's grab your names again and then we'll figure we'll assign you a random team. There's all your names right there. All 30 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. 3 and a 1 four times. 1 2 3 and 4. After four times, we've got Phil down to Jarrell. And now let's assign you a team. Three and a one, four times for the teams. One, two, three, and four. After four times, we've got the Charlotte Hornets down to the Los Angeles Lakers. Why is there another person right here? Is that me? <laughs> All right. Phil with the Hornets, Oliver with the Warriors, Dan with the early bird spot. You get the Trailblazers. Anthony with the Mavs, Danny with the Cavs, Mike with the Rockets, Eastwood with the Pacers, Dan with the Heat, uh, with the Heat, Dan with the Hawks, different H team, John with the Timberwolves, Ryan H with the Sixers, Scott with the Bulls, Peter with the Wizards, Roy with the Suns, Peter with the Magic, Ryan H with the Spurs, Michael with the Nuggets, Roy with the Pistons, Adam with the Grizz, Mike with the Pelicans, two great teams right next to each other there, Peter, Clippers, Knicks, Kings. Tice with the Jazz, Sean with the Thunder, Roy with the Bucks, Michael with the Nets, John with the Celtics, Danny, Last Bond Mojo, Miami Heat, Adam with the Raptors, Jarrell with the Los Angeles Lakers. What are we talking? What are we talking about, Gil? There you go. All right. So for this two box break right here, I'm going to pause the video, allow people a little bit of time to trade. And when we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades and then the break. Stick around. Hi, everyone. Welcome back. There were no trades, no deals were done, but it's all good. There you go. So the two box fat pack break, random team number one. And all the spots are the same right here. Did I not? Oh, there's Dan. Danny has last spot mojo right there. So there you go. There you go. Let's see what we got in this Chronicles, ladies and gentlemen. I think the Chronicles hobby boxes have been selling like hotcakes. I think the per box price on that has skyrocketed. So let's see what these retail packs have in store for us. Good luck, everybody. I guess value packs. I guess there's an exclusive score. Okay, I got to look out for... The exclusive score inserts and exclusive bronze parallels. That's what we're looking out for. There's another two box break in the store that's already in single digits, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to get that going. Now, where do I want to stack these? Like this? We got Portland, Dallas on TV right now. That's the TNT game. Eight minutes left in the first quarter, tied at 10. Very early in the game. Um, are these Chronicles mostly rookies? Yes. Especially the retail pack version. I don't think you're going to see a lot of, a lot of vet autographs or even autographs at all in this. So it's, you're, you're mostly hunting for rookie cards. So my tower is saying score is exclusive to these fat packs. Rookies and stars exclusive to blaster boxes and classics is exclusive to hanger boxes. All right, good, good info there. 
Brian Gomez can't find these retail anywhere. I don't. I don't doubt it. I don't think a lot of you will. So many people will end up buying, snapping things up the day these are delivered to any retail store, and then they're reselling it for probably double the price on eBay right now. I think we probably got these from a dis distributor. I think. I wonder if we get these because we're a hobby shop or if every all, even group breakers get these? I don't know. All right, well, let's roll. So there's kind of, we're kind of all over the place here. So we'll try to save as much of the key players as we as we can. Obviously Zion and and uh, Zion and John Morant will be the the ones we want to look out for, but a lot of good ones here. That was those Kendrick Nunn and Tyler Hero goes to Danny and the Heat. I think who was saying earlier today that was it Oliver maybe? I think it was Oliver who was saying even Duncan Robinsons now, if you find those are gaining some value. There, oh, this guy's almost saying saying Grayson Allen getting some some love on the secondary market. Adam Kupperman with the Grizz. Higgs, what's going on? Paolo says, Luka Doncic will be top five player of all time. Of all time? I mean... He already is a championship. He's, he's got a ring already. He's already got a ring, that's true. Of all time. Of all time. That... That is, that's a bold statement, but that's not a crazy statement. I would take Luka Doncic over any of the milkmen that Bill Russell played against. Milkmen. so bad about modern players I mean, who's who's in your top five right now, Paolo? And who are you taking out of that top five? Not right now, but who's the top five of all time that, that Luka Doncic, who's he replacing in that top five? Um, Who turns into six? I don't know. Bill, like Kobe? Bill Russell or Will Chamberlain or something? Like Kobe's top. Kobe's like five, right? Yeah. I mean, like you got like Jordan, Kareem, LeBron, LeBron, LeBron Kobe, Kobe, and Luka. And Luka? <laughs> <laughs> all right. I mean, only, only two years in, but... But, I mean... Is that bronze? I can't tell. And there's so many good rookies now. Yeah, you can start busting out your TJ Warrens too, Ryan Gomez is saying. Yeah, Bird and Magic are up in there up there too. Who are we who are we taking out? Kevin's saying he it's not over Bill Russell, no way. I mean, I don't know, but then how much does chips count too? Remember in, in a sport like basketball, chips do matter. Like, baseball, the chips don't matter as much. If you're a NFL linebacker, right, chips don't matter as much. Chips matter for QBs, I guess, but, man, I mean, that's... But, again, I think first we have to find out who's in your top five and who is he replacing. You know, I think that's where that's where the argument is. But it's not a it's not a crazy statement though. I gotta see I gotta see a few more years out of out of Luka Doncic before I start making statements like that, but But if 
It's Luka Doncic. If he knocks out, if he knocks out a, a chip or two in the next five years, I think that that's going to be key. An MVP or two in the next five years, that's going to be key. He's got to stay healthy. So much going on here. It's kind of you kind of have to watch carefully what's happening here. All the rookies will ship. I'm trying to pull out some of the key rookies right now, especially the ones we're probably going to see in the playoffs that may carry some extra value. What? Which none? Did... Man, the basketball prices are wild. The score? No, no, prism none. Did I pass a prism one? Are you talking about this? Wow. Anthony Davis prisms? Oh, because the, these are updates, right? Gotcha. Okay, so save all the... Definitely set aside all the prism cards for sure. God, that is crazy. Basketball is wild, ladies and gentlemen. Right, forgot they were forgot they were updates. All those Zions are going to go to uh, the Pelicans, by the way. Mike G. That all the John Morant rookies, of course. This Luminance one looks really sharp. Goes to Adam Coverman and the Grizz. There might have been one Chronicles, like Chronicles based Jason Tatum, but nothing nothing super significant. I mean we're shipping everything in this, right? So I don't have to worry too much. I think vet, it says vet commons don't ship, but I think in this definition, vet commons means this chronicles Nikola Vucevic, you know what I mean? But, I mean, these are all considered inserts, so it might be easier if they just ship everything, I don't know. But 95% of these are going to ship. I, I honestly, I, I don't do the ranking game too often, but... But yeah, I don't know who my top five would be. Would because as Paolo is saying, saying he's his career's already platinum, Luka Doncic. He's thinking MVP next year at twenty two, and then five plus rings over the next decade. I think Dallas will deliver five plus rings over the next decade. Can, will Dallas do that? I think that's the difficult part to think about. Is Dallas going to going to put the resources in necessary, lure in the players necessary to get to get to that level? Porzingis needs to stay healthy. Yeah, they need a much. I mean, they they've got a good core, a healthy Porzingis. If you get a you know Luka Doncic, if he stays hot. That's key, but they, they got they got a, a lot of pieces that they need to I mean they need a lot of pieces to add to that team before you start thinking before you start thinking, man, that could be a championship team. Yeah, top top five is tough, John McCall. You know? Dr. J, Bill Russell, you, now you got to cross eras, Michael Jordan, Magic Johnson, Kobe. <laughs> Which jaw? That 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 jaw that I just passed by 662 has two celebrities in the background.
Second one. I think the next one. Yeah, the second one sold out. So we'll do that again in a little bit. Oh, Michael Orr's adopted parents. Oh, from Blindside. Oh, that's interesting. Are they celebrities? I guess if it, if it was like Sandra Bullock, I feel like that would be a celebrity. It's pseudo celebrities. Ruining cards here. Yeah, that Kendrick Nunn, that Prism Kendrick Nunn, yeah. 100 to 150 around there, maybe a little bit more. But all the Prism cards, which I just realized, all the Prism cards in here are, are all update cards. So that's why there's a little extra value in there. Oh, I can't open any of these packs. Retail packs can be annoying. Yeah, I think basically any prism in these sets, right, Bill, would, would be would be huge. The Anthony Davis, I think. Is that his first? Anthony Davis must be the first one in his Lakers gear, right? which boosts that value, so well, we'll see if we can find more in this box and then the next one. Good luck, everybody. Alright, I gotta sleeve these later. I can't can't do these right now. There's Giannis. I mean, more Kendrick Nunn, which he can certainly significantly boost his value in the playoffs. We want to look out for that. More Zion. More Kendrick Nunn. More Zion, Kendrick Nunn, LeBron, Tyler Hero, Sekou Demboya. That's kind of a weird shot. I was like, is it this? Yeah, this one. Tyler Hero. A little slippery, too. More Zion. Taco Fall Prism. So all these are, are updates. That goes to John McCall and the Celtics. Yeah, I think John Morant has to have the Rookie of the Year locked up. I think this guy, Zion, just didn't play in long enough. I think John Morant did it from pretty much the, the beginning of the season, so... Yeah, that's what we were talking about earlier, Paulo. The uh, the the prism cards are are update cards, prism update basically. Right, so some names we may not have seen, or maybe some updated uniforms and stuff like that. So that that's what they really should do. That's a good call. Yeah, did you hear Nick Jaspi in the background? He's like, why not just do prism series one, prism series two, and then update, and then there you go. Just, just do it. Just do it for all of that. Yeah. 
There's so many different cards, I can't really... My eye has to go to different spots on the card to figure out. A lot of Zions, but I'm not seeing a lot of John ja Morant's. And I, at least in the second box, I thought there was more. Some RJ Barrett's. Still has some upside here. Luka Doncic. Kendrick Nunn. Giannis. And the last little stack here. Jeff Dorlag, what's going on? Great photography in all of these cards here. I dig that. I like the this elements design, I think looks really sharp. James, Jarrell Taylor, you got my Lakers. You're getting all those LeBrons that were that are being pulled there. Luka Doncic, Anthony Ramondi with all the uh, Luka Doncic's that we've been pulling out of here. A lot of Zion's out of here. All of those will add up. Giannis's, those will ship. Those are all going to uh, the Bucks. That will be Roy Ramirez. And at the end is Darius Garland, of course. All rookie cards will ship. That'll go to the Cavs. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. A ton of excellent stuff in here. No wonder this was selling out so quickly. Um, we got another two-box break coming up in a little bit. So check that out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.